Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I would like to give another example on numerical integration. See the statement of the given problem. Evaluate integral log x to the base e dx within the limits 4 to 5.2 by using trapezoidal rule, Simpson's one third rule, Simpson's three eighth rule. First of all, we should divide the range 4 comma 5.2 into equal number of sub intervals. Okay, already we know that. There is no restrictions to apply trapezoidal rule, but there is a restriction, there is a condition to apply Simpson's one third rule. Okay, what is it? The number of sub intervals of the range should be even number. Okay, also what is the restriction to apply Simpson's 3 8th rule? The number of sub intervals of the range n should be multiple of 3. That's why here I will divide the range 4 comma 5.2 into 6 equal parts because 6 is even number that's why we are able to apply some one third rule and also we are observing that 6 is multiple of 3 that's why we can also apply Simpson's 3 8th rule at, at same time okay also there is no restriction to apply trapezoid rule that's why n is equal to 6 is uh, work out for all formula okay so let us divide the range. What is the range here? Limits of the given integral are known as range 4 comma 5.2 into 6 equal parts. You can also divide the range into 12 equal, 12 equal parts. No problem because 12 is an even number and 12 is multiple of 3. That's why you can also divide the range into 12 equal parts. But here I am taking only 6 equal parts. So n is equal to 6. With the help of n is equal to 6, I will find out the step size. Step size is nothing but interval difference. H is equal to what is the formula for H here? B minus A by N. What is B here? Upper limit. What is lower limit? A. So, you will get 5.2 minus 4 by 6, which is 1.2 by 6. I will write 1.2 as 12 by 10. So, you will get 12 by 60. So, which is 1 by 5, nothing but 0 0.2. So, I got step size as 0 0.2. H is known as step size, otherwise interval difference. Now, we have to consider the following data. Okay, you should take x values and uh, respective functioning values. What is the respective function here? Given integrand function, which is log x to the base e, nothing but ln x in our scientific calculator. I will find out the entire data by using scientific calculator. See, once again, I will repeat that swapper trick. So, mode, operate first mode. So, see the seventh option. In the seventh option, we have the table option so press 7 now we have to type the given integrand function integrand function means function inside the integration which is log x log x to the base e that's why i'm operating ln alpha x close the bracket f of x is equal to ln x okay equal to start with what is the starting point of x lower limit which is 4 that's why I am operating 4. And what is the ending point? 5.2 is equal to. What is the step size? 0 0.2. That's why I am taking 0 0.2 is equal to. Directly you will get the data in your table of form in our scientific calculator also. So x values are 4, 4.2, 4.4, 4 4.6. First one is serial number. Second one is second column is x values. And third column is respect to functioning values. 4.6, 4.8. 5 up to 5, 5.2 also. So x values are separated by 4, 4.2, 4.4, 4 4.6. 4 Clearly we are observing that the difference between the x values is 0 0.2. 4.8, 5, 5.2. And finally it is 5.2. Okay. Write the respective y values. At 4. It would be 
at 4 point it is 1.4350 next one is 1 1.4816 1 1.5260 next 1 point 5686 at 4.8 it would be 5686 next at 5 respective y value is 1.6094 finally it is 1.6486 construction of the data is very very important so i will take this is y0 this is y1 y2 y3 y4 y5 y6 after constructing the data we can easily find out the given definite integral by using any numerical integration formula okay see take siding trapezoidal rule i am going to find out the given definite integral value by using trapezoidal rule according to the trapezoidal rule given integral becomes f of x dx otherwise we can take y dx as you wish is equal to h by 2 into it is better to always write any numerical integration formula for given data only okay sum of first and last here first ordinate is y naught and last ordinate is y6 plus 2 into sum of remaining all ordinates between y naught and y6 so you will get y1 plus y2 plus y3 plus y4 plus y5 close the bracket so replace all values integral 4 to 5.2 log x to the base e into dx what is h value 0 point by 2 sum of first and last ordinates so 1.3862 plus 1.6486 plus 2 times of 1.4350 plus 1. 4816 plus 1.5260 plus 1.5680 plus last one is 1.6094 ok first and last here 2 into sum of remaining all terms between them Okay, now I have to calculate this one by using scientific calculator. See, point two by two. First one is take this symbol, point two division two. Otherwise, you can also write directly zero point one into as you wish. Bracket open. 3862 plus 1.6486 close the bracket plus 2 times of 1.4350 plus 1.4816 plus 1.5260 plus 1.5686 plus 1.6094 close double bracket I got 1.8276 right in the bracket approximately okay now we have to find out the similar definite integral by using second one Simpson's one third one third rule okay see Now see the Simpson's one third rule statement. According to the Simpson's one third rule, integral a to b f of x dx is equal to h by 3 whole into sum of first and last ordinates which are y0 plus y6 plus 2 into sum of even ordinates between y0 and y6 which are y2 plus y4 only plus 4 into remaining all ordinates which are odd ordinates y1 plus y3 plus y5 replace these all values from given data 
So integral a to b, what is f of x? Given function, log x to the base e dx. Already we know that h is nothing but step size. In this problem, step size is 0 0.2 by 3 whole into sum of first and last coordinates. See the given data here. This is the given data. Okay. So 1.3862. Plus last one 1.6486 plus 2 times of look at y2 1.4816 plus y4 1.5686 plus 4 times of 1.4 4350 plus 1.5260 plus 1.6094. Now we have to simplify this calculation in our scientific calculator. See. Take this symbol 0 0.2 division 3 whole into open here double bracket 1.3862 plus 1.6486 plus 2 times of 1.4816 plus 1.5686 close the bracket plus 4 times of 1.43 Five zero plus one point five two six zero plus one point six zero nine four. Close double brackets. We got one point eight two double seven. Okay, write in the bracket approximately. Since fifth decimal place is also eight, you can also take one point eight two seven eight as you wish. Now, we will find out the given definite integral by using Simpson's 3a rule. See, according to the Simpson's 3a rule, we know that integral a to b f of x into dx is equal to 3h by 8 whole into sum of first and last ordinates. In this problem, from the given data, for sum of first and last ordinates are y0 plus y6 okay it is better to always write any numerical integration formula for given data only okay plus two times of sum of multiple of three ordinates only which is only y3 here plus three into remaining all terms which are y1 plus y2 plus y4 plus y5 okay now replace these all values Integral a to b given from sorry a is nothing but 4 to 5.2 Okay, in previous Here also you should replace a b values 4 to 5.2. Okay, don't forget it So integral 4 to 5.2 given function is log x to the base e dx 3 into 0 0.2 here step size is 0 0.2 that's why a to whole into y0 plus y6 what are they 1.3862 plus 1.6486 from the given data plus 2 times of y3 see from the given data what is y3 1.5260 plus 3 times of y1 1.4350 plus 1 point, uh, next y2 1.4816 plus y4 1.5686 plus y5 which is 1.6094 please replace these all values carefully in the formula now i will calculate this one by using scientific calculator see okay take this symbol three times of 0 0.2 division 8 open double bracket 1.3862 plus 
six four eight six close the bracket plus two times of one point five two six zero plus Oh, close the bracket for you should close the bracket plus three times of one point four three five zero plus one point four eight one six plus one point five six eight six plus one point six zero nine four close double brackets so which is also gives one point eight two Double seven nine. You can also take it as one point eight to seven eight as you wish. Write in the bracket approximately. You can also check that directly by using your scientific calculator whether your answer is right or wrong. See here, we have an option in your scientific calculator. See, you should you you can see this symbol. Take this symbol. So here function is. log x to the base e in our scientific calculator ln gives logarithmic function whose base is e for x you should operate alpha and this closed bracket so see here and you can close the bracket ln x dx so lower limit is 4 upper limit is 5.2 okay is equal to see see 1.8278 So almost you will get exact answer in Simpson's one third rule and Simpson's three eighth rule. Okay, this is the application of numerical integration. In the next video, I will give some more examples on it. Thank you very much. Bye.